Rovshare is a robotic wheelchair being fully instrumented at ISR since the mid-90s. It is able to perform localization, mapping and obstacle avoidance based on 2D laser scanner. It can be brain actuated by BCI and external devices can be linked allowing networked robotic research. The user steers the wheelchair for a P300 based BCI by focusing during a certain number of repetitions a simple flash paradigm which comprises all possible steering commands. Before the online operation, the system is calibrated to fit the classification models to the user. The calibration takes less than 3 minutes. The user is requested to count 9 repetitions of each symbol flash corresponding to the command that appears in the upper left corner of the screen. Input commands are provided in discrete time intervals. This interval depends on user's performance, ranging typically from 4 to 6 seconds. Although the BCI is always running, at the current stage of the project, the navigation system only accepts commands from the user in decision points. The first test scenario consisted in steering the wheelchair in a structured known environment. When the wheelchair reaches certain target points, where a steering decision is required, it stops and waits for the BCI command. This user needs three repetitions to carry out command selection. At each decision target, only a subset of possible steering commands is allowed, and Robshare only moves to another target point if a decision from the subset is selected. When moving objects appear close to the Robshare, it stops and waits till it is safe to follow the predefined path again. In a multiple direction situation, caused by new obstacles in the environment, the collaborative controller waits for the user BCI command. The final steering is determined based on the information provided by machine and user agents using a matching intent algorithm. The navigation system is also being tested with people that are severe motor impaired. For safety reasons, the tests are being performed remotely. Experiments have demonstrated that users with motor disabilities, such as cerebral palsy users, are able to use the assistive navigation system based on BCI with relative ease.